Up to here, with this desktop flow, our RPA challenge is successfully completed with advanced web form filling actions with dynamic UI elements. But the desktop flow is not organized as per the industry standards. The reason is that if you observe, we are having launch Excel. This is the Excel automation. Another one is web automation from where we are having launch new Chrome to end of close web browser. How can we organize this one? As a part of fourth step, we can create a subflow to organize them with the subflows. I'm going to create a new subflow by clicking on subflow and then I'm going to click on new subflow. So I'm going to give the subflow name as Excel underscore automation. And then I'm going to click on save. Now, what are the steps we have used to read the data from the Excel? We will move all these actions to Excel automation subflow. What are the actions that we have used? One is launch Excel. Another one, get first free column slash row from the Excel worksheet. Another one, read from Excel worksheet. And then a final one is the close Excel. I'm going to copy all these things and then I'm going to move to Excel automation. In a such a way, I'm going to move all these web browser related actions such as launch new Chrome as well as populate text field on web page. Another one press button on web page along with that I will close the closed web browser. All these actions I'm going to move to some other subfolder. I'm going to create one more subfolder. I'm going to give the name as web underscore RPA underscore challenge. And then I'm going to click on save. Now I'm going back to the main and I'm going to copy all these things and I'm going to move all the actions to web underscore RPA challenge. Now I need to call these two subflows that is one is Excel automation, another one web underscore RPA underscore challenge subflows. I need to call that from the main flow. How can we go ahead and do that by using run subflow action? Let me drag and drop this action onto the main flow workspace. As a first step, we are going to read the data from the Excel so that for the run subflow, I'm going to select Excel automation for the first time. And then again, I'm going to drag and drop another run subflow action onto the workspace. Now, second time, I'm going to call the web underscore RPA challenge. Let's click on save. Now, if you observe in our main flow that I'm having two subflows, that is one is Excel automation, another one web underscore RPA challenge, right? Our agenda is the same to complete our RPA challenge, but this is well organized that you can see over here that the Excel automation having all the actions related to the Excel, whereas web underscore RPA challenge having all the actions related to the web action. Okay, and these two subflows will be called from the main subflow. All right. Now let's run the flow to see the output is working as expected or not. And then it is completing successfully or not for the RPA challenge. Let's click on run flow execution started. You can see right now as a first step from the main to subflow that is Excel automation. It has been completed the first run subflow that is Excel automation. And then as a second run subflow, it is trying to open the browser and then it is trying to fill all the data from the Excel to RPA challenge. Our RPA challenge has completed successfully even after moving the actions from main flow to the subflows and that is Excel automation as well as web automation.